It's August 9th again. Just a year ago, it was August 9th again. So welcome to August 9th again. Today is Jeremiah 7 through 9. We entitled this devotion, Repentance Leads to Ch Change Change. <laughs> Repentance Leads to Change Lives. Our focus text is Jeremiah 7, 1 through 8. This is the word that came to Jeremiah from the Lord. <clears throat> Stand at the gate of the Lord's house. Excuse me for just a moment. Stand at the gate of the Lord's house, and there proclaim this message. Hear the word of the Lord, all you people of Judah who come through these gates to worship the Lord. This is what the Lord Almighty, the God of Israel, says. Reform your ways and your actions, and I'll let you live in this place. Do not trust in deceptive words and say, the temple of the Lord, the temple of the Lord, the temple of the Lord. If you really change your ways and your actions and deal with each other justly, if you, don't, if you do not oppress the alien, the fatherless, or the widow, and do not shed innocent blood in this place, if you do not follow other gods to your own harm, then I'll let you live in this place, in the land I gave to your forefathers forever and ever. But look, you're trusting in deceptive words that are worthless. The choice is clear. Repent and live in the presence of the Lord, or stay in your rebellion and be cast out in the place of bondage. Jeremiah stood outside the temple and preached to everyone entering the house of worship. Listen to his message as they came to worship. Don't think you're safe here because you're coming to the temple of the Lord. If you come to worship with sinful desires and plans floating around your mind, don't think that just because you go through the routine and rituals of worship, you're safe. Before you enter the house of worship, repent of the sin that so easily entangles you. Confess your need for forgiveness and cleansing. Ask the Lord to purify you once again through his word. Consider Acts 3.19 as a clear direction from God and approach him in worship. Repent then and turn to God so that your sins might be wiped out, that seasons of refreshing might come from the Lord. Oh God, help us repent and turn back to you. Don't allow us to enter worship with unconfessed sin and unrepented of deeds. Purge us of our sins and purify us Restore us to the joy of your salvation. Amen.